Hello there, YouTubers. It's Spike CNX of the Ping Gamers, and uh, essentially, <laughs> I'm going to be talking about some uh, strange stuff that's kind of happened in the past. Uh, it was a couple years ago. Uh, essentially, you might have noticed I have a brand new microphone. Um, let me know how it sounds in the comments, or you know, whatever. So, uh, bought a brand new professional microphone. Bit expensive, but doing it for you guys, <laughs> you know? So anyway, um, new mic is out of the way, moving on. Um, right, so, as you can probably guess from the uh, title of this video, uh, I had a bit of a few weird but good experiences, and uh, yeah, so anyway, <laughs> Going right into it, I was uh, attending a, uh, uh, it's like a stand-up comedy show, um, live, um, with a friend, uh, uh, I'm not gonna name her, I get, well, Laura, it, just one name, that's fine, and, um, and uh, it was about halfway through, and uh, in case you were wondering, um, it was a bunch of people, uh, different people, uh, I think it was about two people, um, doing uh, some stand-up, and then at the end uh, was about half an hour or an hour of uh, Russell Howard. I'm actually a pretty big fan of his, and the story behind us going, because I normally never go to stuff, is that... Um, she kind uh, Laura uh, called me and was like, Mike, do you want to go see Russell Howard? I was like, uh, what, live? She was, yeah. I was like, uh, sure. So, um, so uh, one of her friends had, uh, had bought two tickets and had fallen sick and couldn't go. <laughs> and um, she turned around, uh, Laura's friend turned around and said to Laura, hey, look, you know, you can have these tickets, just sort of buy them off me, and you can go, you know? So we went, and, uh, anyway, it, it was a great show. Russell Howard is always funny. Um, I did, uh, he said I did the weirdest heckle ever, which was, it was stupid. I was trying to, I, I don't know, I was trying to be funny, but that's, that's probably, okay, so he was talking about, like, these see, like, old portable CD players from like the 90s and early 2000s and I remember that mine and most of them had uh, it was like uh, no skip or unskippable or, or anti-skipping is it, it skipping is when like you sort of barely move it and the laser gets funny with the disc and it's like skip and stuff <clears throat> And uh, uh, so I just yelled. <laughs> he was talking about them, but he didn't bring that up. So I just yelled, you know, Andy, skip my ass, you know, or something. And he just yelled. He just sort of turned around and went, "That is the weirdest fucking heckle I have ever had." <laughs> and I, I, I agree. It was out of context. It is bizarre, and I, I felt very stupid for yelling it out because he didn't understand what I meant. He what you know I I don't know it might be because he's younger than me not by much but still anyway so we were at the comedy show and I was just like oh man uh, it, it was um, we were about halfway through Russell's uh, bit and I was just like oh god I'm gonna wet myself so I got up and um, I was on my way to the bathroom and uh, this guy kind of is just like this and I'm like oh uh, what's up he goes hey you're that pagan gamer guy from YouTube, aren't you? And I went, uh, 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 yeah, yeah, I am, yeah. He goes, oh man, that's cool. I just wanted to like thank you for you know your videos and stuff, and and for doing the reviews that you did, and you know because of you, you know I I didn't go with this person, and and uh, you know I just wanted to thank you for for doing what you do, and then he shook my hand, and I'm very sorry, man, if I don't if I if you told me your name, I I am. 
horrible at names, and this is years ago, so, and, and, I, and you told me once, so I do not remember, and I feel horrible about that, because that moment was the first time I'd ever met a fan in real life of, of me. You know, and it might have just been, oh, it's just some random dude from YouTube. You know, it's just, he's just, you know, he's just here. You know, uh, to you, it, it, it probably didn't really mean much, but to me, it meant a lot because I do these videos, and for me, I'm just sat in my home talking to a camera, you know, and then people watch, and I, well, hopefully, people watch. Um, but to meet somebody in real life and for them to go, oh man, thanks for your videos and shake my hand and stuff was very strange but awesome at the same time. <laughs> I, c I can't even describe it. I mean, can you imagine a complete stranger coming up to you? I know you and then, you know, and, and stuff. So for me, it was, it was bizarre and weird. <clears throat> I was just like, oh man, I would love to chat to you and stuff. But I really need the bathroom. <laughs> he was just like, no, man, it's cool. So I went to the bathroom and, uh, and, and you know, whatever. And then I come back and he's already gone back to his seats. But I, I recognize him and he's like a few rows behind us. I'm just like, you know, he's like, cool. And then I go and sit down and I sat next to my friend, Laura. And I turn to her and I go, <laughs> you won't believe what just happened. She goes, what? What's happened? Are you, is everything alright? Right. No, no, it's fine. Um, and then I told her what happened. And she went, Nah, nah no way. I was like, Yeah, no, that I, I swear. She was just like, Wow, really? I was like, Yeah, uh, it's the first time for me. You know, it's a really big deal for me. I cannot express that enough. It was a really kind of... It was like a milestone for me. Like... For, for YouTubers and stuff, for us, there are different milestones, you know, there's like, oh, I reached a thousand subscribers, oh, I reached blah, 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 oh, my video got so many views, and then for, you know, it's sort of like, oh, you know, uh, different milestones, and for me, it was like, oh, <laughs> it was like, oh, I, uh, I, I, I want to meet a fan, but like, uh, in the wild, <laughs> as as the as, as they might put it, I don't know why is it that. Anyway, so for me, it was like this big milestone for me and my and and what I do, and and I thank you so much for coming up to me and saying hi. You know, um, I was a little nervous though because uh, <laughs> some of my comments on my videos are. A little bit <clears throat> um, aggressive, I suppose. You know, just people calling me a liar. Hmm? You know, no, well, I. Okay. Uh, some people, you know, just saying horrible stuff about me. And uh, I was just like, oh, thanks, you know. <laughs> thanks for saying that. You know, thanks for calling me fat and ugly, because never heard that in my life before you know I'd be very impressed if people could actually genuinely insult me that's not an invitation to go into the comments and insult me well I've probably brought it on myself now so fuck it fucking do it I don't give a shit anymore because at a certain point it doesn't matter to me if people insult me in the comments anymore it, it used to hurt me at first I was just like fuck it I don't care after a certain point because I realized that it was stuff that people wouldn't say to your face and I'm not saying I want people to say it to my face I'm saying that the majority of the people who just spam hate in YouTube comments they typically wouldn't say that stuff to people in person anyway moving on um, so that was that was that was awesome but weird <laughs> <laughs> in, a, in, a, in a great way, you know, and I honestly, if you want to come up, say hi, you know, shake my hand, whatever, you, you know, hell, I'll, I'd be fine with a hug if you ask me, you know, just ask, don't just, you know, <laughs> so, you know, that's fine, um, you know, just have a chat with me, I'm 
the person you see now isn't a character. I'm literally like this all the time, you know? <laughs> I'm, you know, I'm very friendly, I guess, you know. Um, the autism kind of helps with that. Anyway, um, so, I think it was a few months later. <laughs> I think it was a few months later, and uh, Laura and I, same Laura, we went to a convention, and that was fun because I love going to conventions. You know, I uh, I live in the southwest of England, and uh, we have sci-fi conventions here, and I actually cosplay, which is fun, and um, there. The actual event that we went, uh, uh, convention that we went to, was a lot of fun. There were loads of cosplayers. It was a brilliant time, and uh, I cosplayed this time as Goku from Dragon Ball Z, or Dragon Ball. Yeah. Well. Uh, anyway, uh, I didn't have the hair though, because uh, I, I bought this uh, nice wig. It looked great in the picture, but when you buy from China, you pictures they lie <laughs> you know it's like Instagram in real life you know what I mean so I and it was a Super Saiyan wig and I was like fine so I had this hair um, but I was wearing the the Goku costume and I was just like yeah no I'm just like just from Dragon Ball Z anyway, I uh, had this great time and and so I was thinking so um and uh, I'm gonna put up a picture uh, here, maybe as wherever, whatever, uh, of me in the uh, uh, in the costume. Yes, I know I look like a fat piece of shit. This was a couple of years ago when I was still struggling with my weight. Um, yes, I know I'm still fat. Yes, I don't fucking care because it doesn't matter. It doesn't change the wonderful person that I am. And that's what fucking matters. So whatever. Anyway, so uh, so I, I, I cosplayed as Goku, so that was a lot of fun. And um, I even ended up going and doing a cosplay competition. Uh, well, you know, I, I I never go expecting to win. I do it for the fun because you get to show off your costume and. Um, he had to have a laugh and talk to other cosplayers, so it was, it, it, that's the reason I do it. I never, I never go to win. I go to have fun, and that's the point. So I'm there, and there's this person with a camera coming through, and I'm like, "Oh shit! What do I do?" Ah! And I do a, a Kamehameha um, hands, and honestly, God, this person is just like, "Oh, this is," yeah, you know, and sweeps past me and keeps going, and I'm just like, "Okay, I don't know what the fuck that was about, but fuck it, I was on camera." Okay. Turns out that this person was filming for a cosplay music video. If you don't know about cosplay music videos, they are pretty awesome, and they're actually the reason I got into cosplay in the first place. Uh, apart from the amazing costume, is uh, because of these music videos that kind of glamorized and and made cosplaying look amazing. So I I, uh, I ended up being in a cosplay music video. <laughs> And uh, I will put the link for this in the description. That's, you know, the the cosplay music video uh, that I'm in, just because the video is pretty damn awesome, and uh, you know, I want to help them out or something. Anyway, so <laughs> moving on, uh, it got to about lunchtime or, or, or you know, after lunch, and uh, I was hungry. So uh, and Laura was hungry. So we left the convention, which was in this, you know building on its own and the uh, city center is right over the road so we go in there and we're just like oh, fine whatever remember I'm wearing a Goku costume so that was fun so we're walking through the middle of the city center I'm just I I don't know I'm half embarrassed and half not giving a fuck it's weird so we end up uh, going into the main shopping center or or mall as Americans call it and uh, we end up going to Burger King but on the way through the shopping center <laughs> I'm not even joking different person completely hmm? hey man are you that pagan gamer guy from YouTube 
I'm like thinking to myself, again? Okay, there we go. Up the, uh, yeah, yeah, I am. And this person also thanks me for doing my videos and says that they love watching me being stupid playing games and having a laugh and all of this kind of stuff. And I was like, oh, thank you, you know? And I, I said to them, you know, I, you have no idea how much this means to me to kind of be hearing this stuff because it does mean a hell of a lot, you know, for people to not only come up and say hi, and, and that they love my stuff, but also comment. I'm not saying to comment, but to, that when people comment and they're just like, oh man, I love your videos. For me, I'm just, that means a hell of a lot because this person took the time to, to write out the, you know, that they love my videos and comment that, you know what I mean? And that means a lot. You know, I mean, might not, you know, might not sound like it, but it, it does. I was having a bit of chat with, a bit of a chat with this person and they were just like oh man I love your videos and shook my hand and off they went Laura was actually with me and standing next to me this whole time and she's just I, I swear she was stood there while I'm talking to this person and she was just like uh, and the person walks away and Laura turns around turns to me and she goes did that really just happen I go, yeah I, I, it, it's surreal. It doesn't, you know. So we ended up chatting about that while eating. <laughs> and that was fun. Um, wow. So, a few years ago, <clears throat> I had uh, a fan um, message me on Facebook, which was fine. Um, the Facebook, uh, uh, Pagan Gamers page, which is down in the comments. Um, it's the official Pagan Gamers page. You know, we post stuff there. We post like gaming memes. Uh, enough plugging. Um, so I got a message directly to the page, and they were just like, "Hi, you know, I uh, love your stuff. You know, uh, can I go chat to you and stuff?" I'm like, sure, why not? So I end up chatting to this person, lovely guy, just, you know, really, really nice dude. And then, uh, he sends me a, uh, personal friend request. And I'm just like, oh, okay, uh, hmm, bit. <clears throat> but I'm fine, but I'm like, fine, whatever, I don't, you know, it's fine. Um. So, uh, I accept, and we start chatting and stuff, and we chat for a few months, and, uh, the guy's fine, he's not, you know, a crazy stalker or anything, he's just a, he's just a dude who likes my videos, and loves lightsabers, and Star Wars, and cosplaying, and, so, you know, anyway, after a few months of chatting to him, and, uh, and having a nice time, and, and that, um, he's just like, oh, hey, man, I'm coming to, uh, you know, coming to, to the city uh, that I'm in. I was just like, oh, cool. <laughs> and uh, he was just like, do you want to meet up and stuff? I was like, you know what? Yeah, sure. All right. You know, uh, this guy's cool. You know, I've chatted to him a lot. And uh, hopefully he's not scary because people from the internet usually are. So... I met up with him. He was lovely. He was fun. He was funny. We went to uh, a comic book shop and um, and uh, we just looked at some comic book stuff and uh, like uh, figures and just collectible stuff and just chatted for like a few hours and um, and then he was just like, right, sorry, you know, I he picked up some stuff. Um, uh, I think he got a Revan uh, graphic novel, if I remember correctly. Huh. Anyway, and uh, and then off he went, uh, back home again. I was just like, that was cool. And then I realised, you know, <laughs> I just hung out with someone who was originally a fan of mine, or, or my channel, or my videos, or all of the above. And he was, he was chill. He was fine. He was cool. And and now we chat like uh, quite a lot. Um, 
So this guy went from being just a great fan of mine, lovely dude, to being a friend. And that was, that. that's still strange to me. And sometimes I forget that we started at that way. That he started as a fan. And now we're great friends and, you know, I love ch chatting, chatting with him and stuff. Just uh, give me a shout out. Hi, John. <laughs> that's the that's the guy. I'm not going to give out his full name because, uh, you know, he he knows who he is. I know who he is. But, uh, you know, don't, he, yeah. Anyway, so, um, uh, that's it for now. You know, just wanted to say how weird that was for me, just meeting fans in real life. It's still very strange. I'm very thankful, of course, and I love all of you guys who watch this stuff. You know, I know that I do stupid videos, and I really do wish that people would watch my gaming videos more, but, you know, that's, that's YouTube for you. <laughs> you know, I, I try and be funny and stupid and, and just funny in uh, my gaming videos and uh, my informative videos as well. You know, that's, that's about it really. Um, anyway, so, um, once again, thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe if you're in the mood to. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.